What's going on guys? As promised, another Alien Worlds video for you all. Not exactly the video I was hoping to bring, but I'll explain all that as we go along. So, you've all noticed the TLM rewards have dropped significantly, and what was once promised to be a $200 a day passive income has now dropped to below $5. Yep, that's right. But all is not lost. We do have the Binance Planet coming out soon. Uh, the Thunder Dome will come out soon. Um, and I feel like there is still money to be made with TLM and mining and also farming NFTs. So we did start to play around with a little bit of land optimization and tool optimization. But then we had other commitments that got in the way just more profitable projects that we are working on, higher passive income on our planet and trying to complete those cog staking windows as well. But just a little breakdown. Yesterday morning I sold all of my TLM. Uh, so I've raised 22.2 TLM over the past 24 hours. So that's not playing continuously for 24 hours and I'm not very good at clicking it every 43 minutes. So so guys, I think my average TLM per hour at the moment with the current setup and land that I am on is probably about 1.5 an hour. So it is nowhere near what it was a couple of weeks ago. Uh, I think a lot of this is down to there's a lot more people on it. A lot less people are staking on planets now and they're selling on exchanges. Um, and I just think that the inflated price on Binance kind of uh, broke the game a little bit because everyone thought they'd jump on board and we too did think that it was too good to be true but also there would be a higher passive income than what there currently is. So I think that's probably about 12 hours is taken to get to about 22 TLM uh, and uh, its current rate of 28 cents it is up 27% actually it did have a little bit of a pump so um we can see that's about 33 wax. Obviously, crypto is suffering a little bit right now. Some people aren't, but a lot of coins are suffering, and one of them being wax. So I usually convert straight into wax because most of the projects that we're using are running on wax at the moment. So that's only 34 wax at the moment, but wax is only about 15 cents each. So I'm actually only making about five, just under six dollars a day right now and that's that that was a long day as well yesterday was a was a long day um not on my computer constantly but coming back and clicking when i remember so uh let us know down below what you guys are averaging obviously we've gone from about a prediction if it stayed at six dollars of t and the current tlm uh average of prediction of around about you know 180 200 dollars a day which we knew was too good to be true uh then it dropped down to about 20 dollars a day which is still viable that's still seven grand a year guys but now it's dropped down to about six dollars in a pretty intense full-on clicky clicky day which you know you, you've got a way up is it really worth it i'm letting it run passively in the background i'll click it when i can because that extra bit of wax every couple of days is is a bit of a boost and as you can see it is spiking there are spikes um if it does come back up to here then we're 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 in a better position so now the cog staking window's closed and i don't need to sort of you know top up my wax every day uh, I'm probably just going to let this build up now till the Binance Planet comes out and then I'm going to stake it all on there. We will bring out a video of more information when we know more about the Binance Planet or the Thunder Dome. And they're both, I think, going to be quite lucrative towards TLM and NFTs as well, guys. So make sure that you, you know, you don't give up on Alien Worlds just yet. I think it does have legs. Um, just looking over the tool prices now. So uh, basic explosive... If you guys remember, it shot up in price, uh, and now it's come right back down. And again, a lot of people invested, and it didn't really pay out as they were expecting. So you can see that price has actually dropped back down to $37 now, um, just like all the other tools have dropped right back down. 
So, okay, right now it's probably not a viable passive income, but they must be looking to correct that. They, they're working on the Binance planet. They're working on Thunderdome. So they want to reward all of the players for using their platform. And obviously, uh, right now, it's not extremely appealing incentive-wise. Okay, yeah, you might be able to get a decent NFT if you've got a nice NFT build, and then maybe that's worth something on the market. But for mining TLM, it's, it's not extremely viable right now. But prices have come down. Binance Planet is coming out. Thunderdome is coming out. There is still quite a high number of players. Um... So yeah, I don't think it's worth giving up on it just yet. It's still a long-term viable option as a, as a decent passive income. But right now, it's not you know a $30 a day, $20 a day even income. It's more like a $5, $6. So let us know what you think in the comments. Uh, if you haven't already, like and subscribe. And let us know what you think. If you guys have found any new tool setups or land locations or where you're having loads of luck farming NFTs or whatever, drop it down in the comments. Chat amongst yourselves, you know, try and help each other out. Join the Discord if you can as well because the we do have our Alien Worlds channel in there. We've been a little bit absent in that channel recently because we've been focusing on COGS and our planet and stuff like that. But as the Binance planet comes out and the Thunderdome as well, we we will be uh, we will be pumping it a lot more. So hope you've enjoyed the vid, guys. And as always, invest smart.